Good evening. Now, you know, I'm Watch Woman 65, Lisa Boyce. Now, you know, for me to come on this time of night, it had to have been important. This is a quick video, five minutes or so. This verse ought to put, you know how you read the word of God and all of a sudden something comes out at you. Delilah, don't do that. Something comes out at you and just screams. Oh, and thank you for my hat, my beanie, from one of my subscribers. Bless you. I so appreciate this. I love this beanie. But anyway, I had to come on here. I had to show this. This ought to put every Lord shipper under a ship. This verse ought to put every legalist and every Pharisee away for life. And this is the verse. It's in 1 John let me see. It's in 1 John 3, 23. Hold on, let me make sure that's right. 1 John, yeah, 1 John 3 and 23. Now, I'm going to read this, okay, because... I'm going to start at 22 because people want to talk about obedience. And like I said earlier, when they see obedience, we talk, we think about the 10 commandments. Well, I'm about to give you something here. And this jumped out at me like a, like 3d. I'm going to start at verse 22, first John three twenty-two, And whatever we ask, we receive from him because we keep his commandments and do those things that are pleasing in his sight. Verse 23, and this is his commandment, that we should believe on the name of his son, Jesus Christ, and love one another as he gave us commandment. That should put every lordshipper under a ship, like I said. There you go. And this is his commandment. That we should believe on the name of his son, Jesus Christ. And love one another as he gave us commandment. Now, let me go on to verse 24, because it says commandments, which means to believe, number one, and to love. Now, he who keeps his commandments, meaning to believe and to love, abides in him and he in him. And by this, we know that he abides in us by the spirit whom he has given us. Obedience is believing and loving. It's right there in the word. When I read that word, I said, I have to come on and tell them this. Because it came out at me like a ton of bricks. I had to say something. And you know it was important if I got on here at, what, what time is it? It's almost 7.30 here. And I'm about to be with Renee at, in about few, in a couple of hours. But this was important. We have two things to do in this dispensation of grace. Believe and love. That's Obedience. Believing on the Son of Jesus, on the Son of God, <laughs> Jesus, who's Lord, always was, always had been, and always will. I'm going to read that again. 1 John 3.23. And this is his commandment, that we should believe on the name of his Son, Jesus Christ. And love one another as he gave us commandment.
I just thought I'd come on and tell you all that to give you some encouragement. Don't listen to these Pharisees and these legalists telling you that you have to commit your life and that you have to obey. You obeyed the moment you believed. I wanted to tell you that. Don't forget, I'll be on at 930 with Renee Rowland. Good night.